hi guys welcome to the channel welcome to today's video in this video we are going to be fixing generic bluetooth adapter missing on your windows pc so all you have to do to fix this error is watch the video to the end and follow each guide precisely and you'll be able to fix this error so the first step to fixing this error is to open your click on window plus r shortcuts and type in the following d e v m G M T dot M S C click on OK. Once this loads up, all you have to do is click on this view tab and select show hidden devices. And once this is done, just close the window and check if the error has been fixed. But if the error still persists, we're going to go through the next step, which is to troubleshoot your Bluetooth. To do this, click on your Windows button and click on settings. And now I'm going to scroll down to the troubleshoot section. Open it up and click other troubleshooters. So now we're going to come to the others category and click on run Bluetooth troubleshooter. Just wait for this load up and scan through to find a possible fix to this error. Click on apply fix. Just wait for this load up. And it says troubleshooting has been completed and it has fixed the error. So just close this and check if this error is gone. But if the error persists, you're going to go to the last step. Open your start menu and search for services. Open up services. Once this window is open up, we're going to search for every Bluetooth service available and we're going to make sure that they are all running. So, right, this Bluetooth support service, right click on it and make sure if yours shows the start button, click on start and also do the same for the other Bluetooth service. So, we're going to also right click on the Bluetooth service and click on properties. On this startup type, we're going to change it from manual to automatic. Just click on apply. Click on OK. We're going to do the same for the other Bluetooth services. Startup type, make sure it's on automatic. And also the last one. So once you are done with this process, close this window and restart your PC. And this error should be gone forever. We have come to the end of this video. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and turn on the bell notification icon to receive updates on any further video. See you guys later. Thank you.